All right, guys. Uh, so this will be the last um, Sky Factory 2.5 episode today. This will be episode six. I'm trying to do like three a day. Uh, I just noticed. So here we have Bacon Donut. He spawned in our mob spawner. He spawns with a sword. I think all the other ones didn't have any items. So he actually gets a sword. Looks like stone. Maybe not stone. It's not wood. It's too gray on the end for wood. Anyway. Not like he's going to drop it anyway. Uh, so... My storage chest over there was getting kind of full, so I decided to start splitting some things up. Uh, I've got mob drops over here on this side, next to our mob farm. I went ahead and made a little bit more dirt, put some torches around so this spot here isn't spawnable even when the gate's open, just in case I forget to close it. Uh, put a torch up here on the water, because this was spawnable uh, space right here. And I went ahead and put a little farm together over here. I still need to put some fence right there and a gate. I can do that real quick. Throw some sticks together. That might do it. Two, three, four. Yeah, that'll do it. I'll start on that side, though. Just because I have a block to place against over there. And the one in the middle I'll take back out. Right here. Bam. And I'll just toss it in back over here. Right there. And I'll make some more later to finish the edges off with. Okay, now I always do this backwards. It's. Oh, no, I got it right that time. Okay. Planks in the middle for the gate. There we go. Alright, so this will be our little starter farm right here. Okay, just check the recording real quick. So I'm not missing anything. Um. So there's our hoe. Don't really need the bucket on me right now. Food's fine. Alright, what do we want to grow first? Let's see. Maybe sugar cane. Not grass. Okay, carrots are good. Oh, potatoes. Yeah, I got potatoes from zombies or something. That's about the only option. Those are trees. Melon and pumpkin. Okay, how about... I don't really want to do wheat right now. How about... I've only got a couple of spaces. Okay, we can do wheat on the other side. Alright, I was thinking I only had four spaces. So let's go ahead and do all four on this side. This will be carrot, potato, and wheat. The other side will be melon and pumpkin. And those two will grow into these spaces here. I'm pretty sure they need dirt to grow into. Now here's also what I wanted to try out. Does this work? the same as the trees looks like it does not let's try over here just in case no zero percent alright it was worth a try so there I actually kinda wanna throw some bone meal down one to save a little bit of space and one to make this go a little bit faster There. Okay, now let's make a chest to put over there, 
and this is going to have our seeds and our food. Uh, sugar cane, yeah. Apples. I had almost a whole stack of apples. Uh, I was going to make dirt out of it, but it takes... It was 10 to make dirt on 2.4, but I think now it's like 30. It's like 30-something apples to make dirt. I'll have to check the exact number again. But it was a lot, so not doing that anymore. And we'll put the chest right there. I could probably replace this block with dirt right there and put sugar cane down real quick. Or this one in the back too. But if I had more dirt, I would just expand this. I want to do a 2x5 and then let the water go all the way out to 5. Anyway, uh, I had a compressed creeper in the, uh, in the box over there earlier. As he despawned while I was over here messing around. Uh, what else do we want to do this episode? I mean, I'm only at seven minutes. And that's about all I wanted to do was the farm. Oh yeah, here we go. Smeltery. All right. Controller. Um, drain. faucet. Try to at least make the parts, not the bricks yet, not the actual solid bricks. I'll get those done later. Um, let's see, I can make the lava tank if I only use four bricks, but then I need five glass. And to make the glass, I need sand, which means I need gravel, which means I need cobblestone, which means I need dirt. So I'm going to have to make some more dirt. So let's set aside four of those for that. It means I have three left. Uh, nothing really worth making out of three. Just another faucet. All right, is this a achievement? For opening this book up, I guess not. So we'll just put these away for later. Well, there's a mob in there now with no image, which means it's probably a player mob. Who do we have in here? Mylorum? Malorum. <laughs> Malorolum. It's just a Steve model. Okay. Either that is actually somebody's skin, or they don't have a skin, or their model doesn't work in this pack. That puts me at level 15 already. Okay. What else are we doing? You know, I could probably just finish this fence up real quick. I might as well. I'm going to have to do it eventually. Just make a whole bunch of fences. I will find a use for them. Sure. Surely I will. go. That's a safe corner. Um, kind of need to finish this platform too, don't I? It's a little bit of groundskeeping type stuff I need to do around here. 
Is that the right word to use there? Construction. Not all of its construction, technically. Let me just run this out. Right there. Kind of want to have a space behind this on that side as well, but no big deal. Uh, you know, I could just bring it all in one. Leave that one there. I'll just make the fence here. I guess I don't need a space behind it. I don't need to walk around it. It's fine either way. Uh, so if you guys are liking the three episode a day thing, let me know. If it's too much, too little, let me know. Kind of just doing this all in my spare time. I've got a couple days off of work, and I've uh, been waiting on Sky Factory 2.5. So playing it pretty much all the time. Uh, I'm going to make probably a second world that I'm not recording just to do testing and stuff in uh, and it'll probably be like in creative so I don't have to like actually waste a bunch of time there how's the farm going 71 percent on the wheat melon and watermelon stuff a long way to go uh, I could probably go get some bones and make that go ahead and finish those up uh, but yeah if you're liking it Leave a comment, let me know what you're thinking. Otherwise, I have no idea. I'm not a mind reader. Put a gate there, and then I need one more for that side. Bam. All right, I need like three more fence, and then probably some over there later. I actually didn't need that many planks, huh? Let's turn a few of those back into blocks. And then sticks, of course. Always putting them back away before I need to. There we go. And done. Now I can organize all this. I don't have to worry about falling off the edge. Let's put them... I don't want to do like a grid. Or do I just want to make a big mass of them? I'll probably just dash them all in this corner. And I'll put a little step up, use them like a platform or something. Whoops. Okay, that didn't do anything. I 
Let's see, how's that look? I need to move that one over. About to break my axe, it's at one durability point left. Okay, now let's make something else to take up inventory space. Oh, that's not even... Oh, that's fine. There. Now I can get up here and put stuff in. Mobs can't spawn on stairs. So we're good. Probably do the other side too, why not? I'm sorry to have them in my inventory. Here we go. Voila! And for decoration. Just put a post there. Now, should I do this to keep myself from falling off? No, I should be good. And there went the axe. Can I get these without the axe? Yep, cool. Not like it would be a huge waste of resources to uh, delete a couple of fences. Got plenty of wood here. Alright, let's go ahead and throw together another axe just so we have one and another sword because that one's about to break and then we will go kill whatever the heck is in the spawner in the spawn room trying to get some more bone meal real quick let's see who is this not you, Creeper. Okay, I guess that kind of worked. Whoever that is survived. There was a skeleton in there that shot him, set him off. Kiwi fails. And Sevidus. Oh. Hey, Sevidus. You, uh... You a hostile mob? Pretty sure they all are if they spawn in there. Come on over here. And get killed. Oh, there's the rain. Man, I would have been waiting a while to make that crucible. Weather. There we go. Well, we got another essence. Let's go ahead and pull these bones out. I wonder if that, uh... Yeah, I wonder if that increases the growing speed on our crops here. Oh, the wheat's done? It might, there's no, no telling. Okay, those are full. Let's at least get a couple of carrots and potatoes. Grab the wheat. What do we got left? Four. One, two, three, four. And those didn't yield anything. All right. Uh, where am I going? Wrong thing. Food goes there. And let me check real quick on our achievement progress here. So we've got that one. We can go ahead and make bread for that one. That's what I wanted to know. We could make a stone pick for that achievement. I need to make an actual furnace for that one. So we need like 11 cobblestone for a couple of achievements. But I will go ahead, check this real quick. Wait, what was that? Oh. Thatch. So three for bread, or one for flour that you can cook into one each. 
Yeah, that sounds like a better idea. I don't know if I'll get the achievement for that. But it's uh, more food for the same resources. And that's going to be, yeah, one plank or one slab per item. Actually, a little more than one. I need one more to finish that off. All right, let's see if I get the achievement for this. If not, I'll wait and make it uh, the actual wheat to bread way. No achievement. Oh well. Still got the food. And that's what counts. Alright, so we have a functioning farm. Um, our main platform is totally safe. We've got all of our barrels organized nice and neat now. I don't have a use for any of this water except for to make clay out of. Do I need more clay? Let's find out. Witchery bottles. Um, I could probably make a couple more buckets. This is all ceramic dye. Yeah, besides grout, what the heck is this? Petrothium dust. Petrothium dust? See, now I haven't even heard of that one. Huh. That's a new one to me. Yep, yeah, 13, 14, more die, more die, more die. Bricks. Oh yeah, we're gonna need the bricks though. Coke ovens, blast brick ovens. Composter. Bioreactor. Roof tile, huh. Yeah, I'll find a use for them. Let's go ahead and make... Um... Why not all of it? While it's raining, these will fill back up. I'll probably have to break these and replace them anyway. Alright, there's 20 clay blocks. Hang on, let me check real quick. Is there... I don't need that open. Besides the crops, which I'm kind of working on, so leaves if I get shears, which means I need iron, and by then I'll have the smeltery. Three saplings, rotten flesh, and sand. But every sand came from a cobblestone at some point. So that's just turning cobblestone into dirt that I'm going to use to make more cobblestone. But then I'm wasting material, so... Actually, that's not as efficient as I thought. But if we go and make too much uh, sand, or gravel even, we can go and reverse the process by starting over with dirt. Uh, composting, okay, so... How many... let's see, seven fish... six full melons to make a dirt block, okay. How about the pieces of melons, the slices, oh donuts, five donuts for a dirt, mutton, 32, that's probably how many apples it takes too, that's what I'm kind of looking for real quick, how many apples did it take, it's probably 32 because a lot of these are 32, 10 rotten flesh, okay. I thought it was also 10 apples. It might have been in 2.4. 7 pumpkin pies. Huh. 
32 carats. I guess is they're just fairly easy to get. 32 zucchini. Just kind of browsing through the list here. Seven bread. Huh. So seven wheat, technically, we can make a dirt block out of. That might be worth doing. Six jack-o'-lanterns. Those need torches, though. Thirty-two pumpkins versus six jack-o'-lanterns. Okay, that's very much worth it compared to pumpkins. Five toast. And toast is just cooked bread. Yeah. So that's five. Whoops. That'll be five five wheat five wheat per dirt block. That's already better. Just requires some fuel. Which I'm okay with because we're making charcoal out of all this tons of wood that we have. 25 melons, okay. So the slices would probably be better to do instead of the blocks for melons. No, wait, how much was it? Seven melons? Or five melons? How many was it? Six, okay. And those are nine slices each, yeah. So the slices are better, because it would need 54. Yeah, so half as many slices. Uh, where is the actual wheat? Did I pass it? No, 13. Wow, okay. So if we make the wheat into bread and then cook that into toast, then we can do almost triple that efficiency. Grass, I'd need shears for that. And then bone meal. Where's apples? It was probably 32. Yeah, there it is. 32 apples. It was a lot. Chocolate roll, no image for that. So eight of any sapling, 32 apples, seven of most fish, there's five of that one. All right, yeah, I think to make dirt, we're going to just start using wheat, because that's easily renewable. Yeah, we can just turn wheat into bread. Uh, let's go ahead and take the carrots and potatoes out and put down some more wheat. And this will be our new easy dirt operation over here. Anyway, uh, so farm starting on the smeltery. And I'm going to get back to... Oh, I guess I hit the, hit the shift button there. Yeah, I'm going to get back to uh, making some more dirt real quick so I can expand that farm th with this method. Because I need a lot more dirt than that to get cobblestone from. Because I need more of these bricks. Uh, these. Nope, that's dark steel. Uh, seared bricks. I need more of these. So, until tomorrow's couple of episodes... I guess I'll see you guys later. Have a good day.